Hello and welcome. My name is Steve Pugh and on this channel I mostly talk about business and entrepreneurship type stuff but I also love tech, I love cameras, I love lighting, I love everything to do with kind of streaming and podcast. So one of the things that I wanted to do is I do two minute tech reviews where I basically talk about stuff that I've bought which I give you a good honest review on. Uh, I don't get paid to do any of this, it's just my genuine honest opinion on stuff that I've bought that hopefully it might help you. Um, so one of my recent purchases with this, so it was an Elgato Stream Deck XL, so I went for the bigger 32 button one I think it has I'm basically I'm mega mega impressed and what I always used to do was use hotkeys on my Apple wireless keyboard to kind of switch scenes when I stream and it was fine but it didn't really work and I was kind of limited with what I could do now that I have this I'm going to try and lift it up because it's still plugged in you can see it the ability to actually kind of customize it to then you know set it for all your different stream and sound effects and camera angles and stuff is brilliant but actually you can also set it for all of your applications on your Mac where you arrange them on the desktop because I have a multi kind of monitor setup and even to automate tasks and do <laughs> loads of really cool stuff that is so, so useful. And even down to launching websites and uh, browser speed tests and that kind of thing. Um, so I got the Excel version, which is 178 pounds here in the UK. Really love it hundred uh, percent because when I actually stream, I'm currently a few meters away from my iMac. I actually bought a five meter, uh, ex you know, extender cable to go with it. So that's USB C to USB A. In the back of the Stream Deck, it's actually USB C. I couldn't find the information anywhere, but that works a dream. I was worried that you wouldn't get enough power transmitted, but actually that works a dream. Um, and yeah, basically, if you ever think about getting one of these definitely definitely worth your time and then the other thing which is worth a note as well so although i got the bigger button one you don't actually necessarily need to do that because if you go to the bottom corner you can actually program different like layers or screens of icons so actually even if you only have the the small or medium sized one you're not actually going to run out of space it's all to do with how much stuff you want on hand etc um so would i buy it again yes absolutely love it uh, you should too um, yeah, there you go. Nice and simple. Uh, if you like this or, you know, please feel free to like and subscribe. And if you need anything, please feel free to shout. Cheers. Bye-bye.